I think they're a real lifeline for people. I um, I suffer from anxiety myself, and it can be a really nice place to come. Something like a library, or a, you know, somewhere like Wallace House and things. They're very interesting places to come to relax and just sort of, you know, you can find a book. You can find uh, you might see people you know. It's it's a it's a real lifeline for people, definitely. So they're very worth it. Council tax has gone up a lot because I'm on my own, I live on my own bungalow and the council tax has gone up really expensive, I live in a one bedroom bungalow and I think it's okay, yeah. Uh, I've got no real concerns about the council themselves, I mean the, the, the facilities, the library and whatever are brilliant. My great concern at the moment is road safety. Um, the standard of driving uh, within the last couple of years has been absolutely abysmal. If you could change something, what yeah. would it be? Well, for cheaper bus fares, because in the morning I pay £2.50 on my bus from Hunderbourne, I only call past nine bus, then I can use it all the time, yeah. I would just say possibly maybe a bit more the council could do for, for people with, with social care maybe sometimes, you know, would with um, obviously they have uh, non-council sort of private groups, but maybe for, for some elderly people who can't always get out and, you know, for some people suffering from mental health issues as well, there, there might be something they could maybe do a little bit more council for them, but that would be it.